Hey guys, it's Anoy Tech HD here, back with another video. So in this video, I'll show you how to make your custom ringtone on your iPhone. So let's get started. So this does work on the latest iTunes 12.7 or above. I'm using the 12.8 version. So first, all you need to do is open iTunes. So guys, you need to have the song uploaded in your iTunes library. So go to your iTunes library and then select a song. So I'm gonna select so I'm gonna select this song, this song right here. Right click on it and go to song info. So when you click into the song info, you're gonna have to go to the option section. Here you're gonna find a start and stop section. So you're gonna click on the start and click on the stop. And you're gonna enter the seconds that you're gonna have as the ringtone. So remember guys, it's supposed to be 30 seconds or less. So I suggest you to put it as 29 seconds. The limit should be 29 seconds. It could start from anywhere, but it should stop with plus 29 seconds so you gotta remember that so I'm gonna put it as 29 alright so 30 seconds and then you, you gotta click OK for it after you click OK you're gonna get a 30 seconds audio of this so if I'm gonna play it I'm gonna get only 30 seconds of it so after this what are you gonna do you have to click the song go to file go to convert you have to click the create AAC version so when you're gonna click on the create AAC version gonna create a new version of it. It's gonna create the AAC audio of it. So now we're gonna right click and then go to show in Windows Explorer. So when you do that you're gonna get this file and this is gonna be the M4A version. So if you don't know how to get the extension on your uh, Indian path you're gonna do is search for extensions. So you're gonna go for search for extensions you're gonna have this option called show or file I hate extensions. You go there and then you gotta tick out the hide extensions for known file types and then click ok you're gonna see this so how do you already do all you need to do is click on rename and then you gotta go here and then change it to r click ok and then click s so you're gonna get this file called m4r all you need to do is bring it up somewhere let me give it in the desktop now you gotta connect your iphone make sure you connect your iphone to the itunes so my iPhone is loading. So after it's done loading, you gotta you gotta you gonna open this section called devices. You're gonna click on open and gonna go to the tones section. So after you go to the tones section, you'll have this file called M4R file. All you need to do is drag the file inside the tones section. So after you're done dragging, it's gonna show up like this. Now you can go on and eject your iPhone. You can go on and eject your iPhone, and then if you go into the settings. And then if you go into the sounds and haptics, and again then you go into the ringtones, you're gonna find it on the top. So thank you for watching, guys. That's all you need to do to bring the uh, bring your custom ringtone to your iPhone. If this video helps, give it a thumbs up. If you have any doubts, just drop a comment. I'll reply as soon as possible. Thank you for watching, guys.